Hey you guys. Hi, it's Mary White, the Cooking with Cannabis Lady. And you know, I'm always trying to get you guys to make your own medicine with our friend Cannabis. But what I've found is that a lot of people don't have the time or they don't have access to, you know, the stuff you need. I've been looking for a while for someone to partner with. And I found Green Revolution. Uh, I, I can't even begin to tell you how much I love these products. They're beautifully made. They're like elegant. They're, they're, um, they're, they're just really good and <laughs> work really well. And what I wanted to show you guys today was um, a recipe that I made up for my friend Josh because Josh can't have dairy and he can't have gluten. And it seems like a lot of people are in, kind of in that same boat right now. This one is super simple, you guys. It's one of those recipes where if you have been involved in medicating, you can still make this. And depending on how high you are, you can make it chefy or not chefy. What I've got is six ounces of Trader Joe's creamy almond yogurt. So again, it's it's a yogurt alternative, and this has uh, got some vanilla flavoring in it. Okay, so, so complicated. Here we go. Now the other part of this, of course, is your pumpkin, but I want to talk a little bit about the nuts. Now I'm using almonds because I'm using this almond yogurt. But if you used like coconut yogurt, flakes of coconut, right? You see what I'm doing there? So I'm gonna very carefully divide this delicious stuff into each one of these. See? Ta -da, ta -da. So that's in there, cool. The other thing, the main thing is the pumpkin. And I like saying pumpkin. My dad used to call me pumpkin when I was cute and little. <laughs> And adorable. So you got basically the same amount of pumpkin as yogurt. I'm going to gently put in a tablespoon of, yes, our friend, pumpkin pie spice. You really can't go wrong this time of year with pumpkin pie spice. Come on. Okay. A little of that. Delicious, delicious. You got to have salt. That's one thing I want you guys to really be aware of. When you are making sweet things, always use a little bit of salt. It really helps balance it out. It makes it a lot more um, palatable. What we're doing here is we're putting all the goodies in the pumpkin. So this is obviously going to be a little bit mushy. So this is where we do two tablespoons of brown sugar and you want to pack that brown sugar. Okay, so pack that in there. Now, my normal recipe, the one, you know, the really fattening one, calls for a glycerin-based tincture and it's it's good and you know you do get medicated but it's intense this glorious stuff from green revolution this is avocado oil based and it is incredible i mean honestly you guys i use a lot of tincture this doesn't you can put it under your tongue it just disappears and then you feel better um, but what i'm using today is an indica and that's the other thing about the green revolution these things not only do they tell you exactly how much CBD to THC, and this is a one to 10. So in your dropper, you're gonna get one of CBD and 10 of THC, but it's also indica, right? So this, these little parfaits would be great for after dinner. You're not gonna get real messed up, but you're going to get a lot of really nice indica, a little bit of CBD, and a little bit of THC. And oh look, I'm putting in a lot of proper there. Because again, this normally takes, I use a tablespoon of my stuff, but this stuff is, I'm gonna say it's a cleaner formulation, if, if that makes sense. What you wanna do is you wanna make this thick enough so it's not gonna mush in with the uh, yogurt. And you guys, you can do your layering any way you want of course. And if you are a vegan person or a gluten-free person, feel free to get your favorite gluten-free cookie and, you know, crumble it up in there, right, rather than the almonds or whatever you want. What I'm going to do here is I've got my yogurt, okay? We're going to do a little bit, if I can open them, of these almonds. Now, you have your friends over for dinner and you've had quite a lovely evening and everyone's just la 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 la, right? Even if you kind of forgot to make dessert, you could definitely run into the kitchen and rip these up and everyone would love you even more. So then just a little bit of this wonderful, wonderful pumpkin goodness. 
Yes. A little bit over here. And really, you guys. Really? That's it. Uh, you're going to want to put more nuts on there, of course. And woo! And these are actually really, really good if you make sure they're nice and chilled before you serve them. Okay. But. You can even put nuts on the bottom and then nuts in, in between each layer. I just want to show you how it's done. So nuts, nuts, and honestly, if that's all you did, that would be glorious. But this is what I like to do. Top it off with a half a dropper of Green Revolution Glorious Avocado Oil Tincture. And then, ooh, here's some mint. And then, if you really want to be chefy, just get out your nutmeg grater. <laughs> this is my favorite thing in the kitchen, my nutmeg grater. I just love it. But see, if you do this and your friends are all sitting in there really high, right? You're like, oh, chefy. And it'll be really impressive. Mm -hmm. That smells so good. There. I'm gonna make sure they're okay. So, this is the Okay. Oh. Yes! Yes! The tincture is so damn good, you guys. You don't get any vegetal flavor, none of that pot. God, this is good. Okay, I'm all excited now. Um, I just want to tell you guys again, Green Revolution makes an excellent product. And if you need any information, maryjwhite.com. I gotcha. You can ask me anything. I answer all the emails. So, maryjwhite.com. And honestly, you guys, get yourself some Green Revolution. It's so good. See ya.